In this video, I'm taking a look at this wood repair kit. Okay, so I'm taking a look at this wood repair kit. So you could use this on wood you're going to be building with. It has cracks in it if you wanted to. Uh, you could use this on furniture, uh, anything around the house basically. I have a small piece of trim around the pantry door that needs repair. So this is what my purpose will be. So it's actually a really nice box. It even has like a little bit of a quick start guide. And uh, yeah, so nice information. So included with this, some documentation. So it kind of walk you through how you'll actually do the repair. Some small paint brushes. You've got some wood putty, gloves, 220 grit sanding block, and you have two different style spatula, scraper, slash spreaders. Furniture repair markers. So we have like cherry, burnt sienna, maple. Three bags that contain the, the wood filler. So we have our different colors. Now, the repair that I'm gonna do I've looked at it. It's fairly superficial. What I plan to do is really just focus more on finding a color that matches and trying to get a nice color match so that it's not so obvious. Now, if you want to find out more about this, there'll be a link below the video. You can check that out. Thanks for watching. All right, so I got a little carried away with the markers testing out different colors and ended up putting too much to give you a before. So you see this corner piece that's been cut so that it's just the end showing. It's very white, very bright, very, very noticeable. And then this right here, that's what it looks like on the repair that I did before I started. It just looked like that. So that's what the before looks like. Let me take you in the other room and show you what the after looks like. Not, or simulated not in the wood. So basically this is the repair area right here. And I tried to do a little bit of dark and light kind of blended together as far as the actual marker goes so that actually worked out quite well because it kind of blends into this and even though it looks sort of more noticeable on camera in person and when you're further away you see it really close it looks bad but when you're further away from it it really just kind of blends right in so it's not really noticeable and it's not that bright white contrasting color so it definitely stands uh, well stood out and doesn't really stand out now unless you know to look for it Not perfect, but definitely an improvement. It's a whole lot less noticeable. You won't just see it right away. So, yeah. Overall, very happy with the results. Used uh, you know, a couple of different aspects of this. So I didn't really need the wood putty. Uh, I just needed the actual filler. You know, the colored fill, uh, fillers that you saw right there. So, used two different colors to kind of blend a little. Could probably do a little bit more if I really wanted to get picky about it. And uh, yeah, use the sanding block just real lightly in the scraper just to make sure I didn't have any too much major uh, left over. So anyway, that is it. That's a couple of quick demonstrations of some different uses, uh, some of the different items, most of the items in the actual kit. That's it. Hopefully that is helpful. If you want to find out more, check out the link below as stated before. And again, thank you for watching.